I'm back with another painting video and this time it's going to be um, about a mushroom. I do love mushrooms. So I'm going to be illustrating Belitis edulis, which is um, like edu edulis sounds like edible. So it's like, um, um, it's a pretty famous mushroom. It's the sep um, or penny bun mushroom. There's several sort of names for this mushroom. Um, in German it's Steinpilz and in Dutch it's Eekhorentjesbrood which translates to squirrel bread which I find really funny um, just wanted to share that and Steinpilz means stone mushroom which is also kind of funny um, it looks a bit like a stone I guess and they're very delicious so I thought I would illustrate it with some insects munching on it because um, dung beetles, for example, they do this really funny thing where they kind of like munch off the bottom bit of the mushroom. So it's like the cap and then you've got the gills, but this one's got pores, they're like little holes. Um, so they kind of munch off the pores and then they, they make their way through the pores. I don't know, I can't really explain it, but it's very funny. So I thought I'd illustrate those. And I've done quite a few studies on it now and I'm almost done. So uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy this video. So I am currently designing the kind of setup of the um, Belitis Edulis painting that I'll be doing and I'm just playing around with um, different designs and kind of like where I'll put the mushrooms and how I'll show them and I think this is kind of the size of the painting that I want. Um, I think it's A3 and I think that's a good, good size so yeah, stay tuned. update I found a nice place to paint in. Hello so um, I am working on the mushroom painting today and I'm uh, gonna try and do some color matching. I did some test sketches or like paintings I guess um, and I worked with different watercolors so with these, these are really old, I got these when I was like 14, they're from Schminke and I've replaced most of them with other ones. And then I use this relatively new set from Arteza, which is really lovely. Um, and I've just been kind of using both of these, trying to mix some colors. Um, I'm gonna try and probably do some better color matching for this because I'm not that satisfied, but I like these colors. These are really good and I love the moss. So I think we're getting somewhere. That's how far I got with my mushroom illustrations. Um, I was just kind of practicing the colours. I think it looks okay. I still have quite a bit of work to do, I think. So practice-wise, they're not great, but oh well.
Hello, so uh, I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, the illustration is done, as you probably saw. <laughs> uh, this is what it looks like. Um, the colours are a tiny bit off. I'm not super pleased with kind of the uh, forest floor, whatever you would call it, the ground, the bits here. Um, I think I might add to that, but for now I'm going to leave it like this and come back to it maybe in a few days or so and see if I can improve anything but yeah this is kind of the end result um, I hope you enjoyed watching the video and if you did yeah just leave me little thumbsies or a little non thumbsies when you don't like it um, or tell me what would be better so I can do a bit better um, yeah thank you for watching <laughs>